Hello Americans. Hey guys. Welcome back to the channel. Guys, if you're new here, I'm Dan. I'm Emily. We're American Acres, full-time RVers that love to watch movies. Today we have 8 seconds, 1994. Wow. 20 years ago. 30 years ago. 30 years ago. Wow. It's been recommended a couple of times on our other True Story reactions. Luke Perry, we just saw Stephen Baldwin, famous bull rider. It's supposed so, to be a true story, so probably some we've tragedy. seen Million Dollar Baby. Yeah. We know how that one goes. Probably some tragedy. Yeah, I don't know anything about it other than that. I don't know who this guy was, how big of a deal he was. I'm going to say we're located in Texas. Yeah, <laughs> Texas, Oklahoma, right? Maybe somewhere in there. Yeah, no clue, but I'm ready. I'm ready too. Let's watch a movie. God, God. The baddest Chicano in the barrio. No, that ain't me. Not anymore. Ever since the kid died, man. Yeah. I'm sorry, what? Eight seconds. American Northwest. A True Story, Oklahoma, 1968. Oh, we've got little kid rodeo. Oh, I ride sheep and stuff. Yeah. That's fun. Look at his little chaps. <laughs> Flame. That's the most adorable thing I've ever seen. And the courage that it takes to be a champion in this game. Yeah, he's been doing it for years now. Champion rider of the Ardmore Team Rodeo. He cowboyed up <laughs> in the judges' life. Clyde Frost, 1963. That's his dad. True, but it is the first time that you have ever rodeoed with Tuff Peterman. Tough. Tough. T U F F. Tough. Oh, Stephen Baldwin. <laughs> Where in the heck is that stupid idiot pencil neck son of a bitch? Yeah, he'll be here. You ready? Just waiting on you, bud. I got one. It's hard, full of juice, and barely fits in my jeans. Gee, tough. It's my flash lane. Come <laughs> Tremendous performance this early in the oh, season. Oh, we got a love interest. no newcomer to the sport. She was the national back there in 1980. And she's been riding one of the fastest quarter horses on the circuit today. Love at first sight. Yeah, well, he stays on and makes a good ride. That's the other half. Aww. 83, good enough to win. That poor hat. A little bit, turn your toes out, get a hold with them feet, chest up, arm out, you're going to cover them real fine. Let's see it. <laughs> I like him. I like his character. Luke Perry's doing a great job. Yeah. Um, we're fixing to get us a bite to eat, and I would surely appreciate it if you could join us. Light. Let's go, butthole. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I won five hundred dollars, though. Well, a little more try. You could have won a thousand. Wow. Thanks, Dad. I don't drink a whole lot. Well, he's trashed. Yeah, he's a cowboy and a nice guy, Lane. Drinking, loving, fighting. Like you do? Boy, he's wrecked. Oh, yeah, he is. Right? Yeah, there you go. Good night. Get off my stuff. At least you got a buddy who's decent enough to take your shoes off. Yeah, you fall asleep with your shoes on, you pass out with your shoes on, it's game on. Yeah. Panda bear. Yeah, man, come on. Woo. 
Nice ride today, Lane. What a burger. Wow. I got so many plans. I don't know how I'm going to get them all done. Right? I say it's not if you get hurt riding bulls, it's how bad. Yeah. I mean, them little kids that come back here, well, they need somebody to look up to. I look up to my dad. Rodeo is not just about winning and making money, but it's about, it's about it's being a good guy. and helping others to yep. be their best, too. You know? This is something I've dreamed about ever since I was a little kid. Now I'm living the dream. Yeah, I mean, it's similar to her dream. Yep. He's just a all-around good soul. It's like you tied onto a tornado, you know, and you get all that energy, just jumping. You know? I bet it is. No, I like the music, too. It gives there. me that City Slickers vibe. It's right. Like, <laughs> almost makes it borderline feel like a comedy adventure. Yeah. For a true story. Yeah, I mean, he said the past couple of months, so this, they're kind of jumping through time pretty good. Hi. Hi. Is this her house? Yeah. Oh. Just passing through, you know, I thought I'd stop by. Are we going to Nebraska? Lane, Texas isn't on the way from California to Nebraska. <laughs> A puss in love. It's beautiful. It's sweet. You know, Kelly, Del Rio's the first real big bull ride of the year. I'd be plum tickled if you come watch me. Well, I'm tickled. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. Oh, Can yeah. we kiss can already? Place here. Yes. Perfect for the wedding. What wedding? Oh. Yours mine. I'm glad you told me. <laughs> I'll try to keep the day open. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> like I said, very adventure Jaws adventure music. Right. Yeah. Woo! Oh, she's there. Studying yeah. in between. Right. Must have been a good kiss. Okay, boys. Let's go, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, man. Oh. Oh. Ah. Oh. Is my dick still there? <laughs> Such a romantic book for a while, but he's gonna be fine. One last little thought's gonna keep going through that pretty little head of yours over and over again. I'm a puss. Uh -huh. I was the best goddamn bull rider in the circuit and I chickened out. I got two words to say to you. What is it? Cowboy up. Cowboy up. Oh, really oh, up yesterday. Right? right? Yeah. Oh, he is in some pain. Trouble. Double trouble. Okay, boys. Okay, boys. Come on. Come on. Yay. I've done something right. I got second place. You're just lucky the other boys rode so poor. Damn. Dad sucks. Uh oh, we've already got our shirt off. Are we gonna have some sexy time? Oh, maybe. Roll oh, she hell. Not anymore. Oh. Yeah. Oh. 
Oh, we did get married at her property. Well done. Yay. If I ever mess up, you just take an old frying pan in my hand. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit, Vince Gill. Really? Yep. Oh, I know the voice. We got a 1984 dance off. Cowboy dance off. Oh my god. <laughs> How'd you get the name tough? When I was four years old. So they started calling me tough nut. Got shortened. Tough nut. Oh, yeah. That is a long camper for two axles. Look at the length of this thing. $600. Can you believe that? $600. Ugliest thing I've ever seen. Oh, come on, honey. We're allowed to keep the TV and all them eight tracks because they all even get banjo strung up if you want. <laughs> You can see it's real homey. Right here is the bath yeah. suite, the shower, and curtain. Well, that was generous. <laughs> what in the world? Fifth in the world. That's not his style. Shirts? Yeah, I think so. But, like, bright purple and everything? I wonder if that's going to be his style. Good. Yeah. I like it. Yeah. This first world's title is going to be easy. Isn't it? Well, <laughs> I don't think it's ever easy. Yeah. Like Cody Lambert and Jim Sharp, you know, Jim's riding real good this year, so it's going to be tough, but I'm just real tickled to be here. Tickled to be here. I mean, we've been trading places all year. Sometimes he's in first, and next week I'm in first, and well, I'll tell you what. Lane Frost, great bull rider, terrible liar. <laughs> <laughs> now, if he gets an 86 points or higher, nobody else can catch him here in the competition. Yeah, oh, man, he's killing it. Man, this sure does look like it's actually Luke Perry riding some of these bulls. It looks like it's actually Luke Perry riding some of these. Yeah. But... Oh, oh, oh. Hung up. Oh no 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 no! Oh, our bullfighters, get him off, ladies and gentlemen. They got him away. Oh no. <laughs> Your new world champion, one of Texas. Lane Frost has already won the world's championship. Well, that's hard luck. You drawing Red Rock on your last bull? Sheep. I don't care when I draw him. Be the first cowboy to ride all ten bulls at the national finals rodeo. First oh. Oh. Hang on, hang on, hang on! That makes him victim 305! Oh, damn! No, 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 you rode real good. Of course, now the but job is staying on top. That's the next you. thing, the next thing. If you're a real champion. Not like he didn't just win the championship. Of course. I'm a world's champ now, man. Does that count for something with you? Mine. Oh. oh, come on, man. I'm the world champion now. People are looking at me. I wasn't thinking that we got a great marriage. I thought we did. Yeah. It's all just his dad's Man. stuff. Well, yeah, he wants to be a champion for his dad. And his dad's like, well, that will be, you know, he keeps moving See, the goalposts yeah. on him. Right. And he's so bent out of shape about it. Like, he's, it means nothing to him. This is the biggest dream of my if it means nothing to his dad. Yeah. Real proud of you, Lane. Real proud of you. Thank you too, Kelly. 
Yeah, look at the van. That's so great. Oh yeah, Brooks and John. Lots of great music in this. Right? Get your merch. Get your shirts. Get your stuff. He's a real fan. Oh my god. Okay, sure. That lipstick is awful. Yeah. I think one of them buckle bunnies from last night was looking to have the two of me. Buckle bunny. I've never heard that. That's great. Got some place outside town. I got too late. He couldn't drive me back. Oh my god, he has a hickey on his neck. Yeah, yeah he's lying about the girl to them right now. I swore. Sorry. It's just a usual. Just the guilt. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Red Rock, Lane Frost. Versus, versus. Lane Frost. Heck yeah. Red Rock hasn't been ridden in 309 tries by the world's toughest bull rider, including Lane. Wow. This is the most important day of my life. And you're picking a fight with me now. I've got to go talk to some of the people. You coming? Man. Stop it. Can I change my mind? No! Wow. Just like that? Just like that. Envious of the way that you handled that horse. His name was Crawford, wasn't it? This guy's good. He's saying all the right things. Would he do the same thing for you? Go 500 miles out of the way with... Yeah. Go to Texas to see her. Who was it? Martin Hudson. But does it matter if it's her ex-boyfriend or some random chick that knocked on his door? It doesn't make a difference. How do I know what you're doing here when I'm out there on the road? I've been here, Lane. He was already accusing her of that, though, and it turned out to be true. That's true. You remodeled your dad's place. You even built him corrals. You can't buy his love, Lane. Ooh. Oh, this is Damn. That was quick. That was so quick. Ugh. Oh my gosh. There ain't nothing I can tell you about bull riding. You don't know. Now we have the heart to heart dad fixings. I don't say what I feel very much, <laughs> but I hope you know that. Oh, well, let's go on up the house. Look at that tape. No, come on, man. I could probably find something to pick on. <laughs> All right. How's the neck? Just hold my head on. <laughs> Do you ever think you're going to get Red Rock Road? Might as well lick your wounds and learn to live with it, because the prettiest oh. thing you're going to start waking up to every morning is me. When you told me about that other guy, I wasn't even mad at you. All the things I said, I should have been saying to myself. There you go. Yep. I just want to spend my time with you. I want to wake up with you in the morning in a real house. You and me forever. You and me every day. <laughs> always. Every eye is on this young man. Let's do it. All right. Now a bull that has bucked off 311 cowboys. The last time. Here it is. Will this be the first man in? Come on! Come on! Not since Freckles Brown rode Tornado. <laughs> uh, another shirt. His legacy is Rodeo. And Cowboy is his name. That was great. That was good. <laughs> Let's go. I hope it doesn't go bad. His bull is called Taking Care of Business. Hey. Yeah. Oh, 
no. Damn. And there it is. You guys can't do this to me. You don't just get to cut to a casket. Mm. That happened so fast. And I know that's exactly what it's like. It happens so fast in a situation like this. I'm going back to school. I'm trying to make plans. She had so many plans. Back in the spring, Lane said. This is your year. Now it's only a week away, and I really think that I got a chance. That's killing me. Chuck Peterman has declared that he will win the world title in memory of his fallen partner, Lane Frost. Do it, Tuff. Look at this. He's proving what he said he can Come on. Do. Come on. He did it. No, he's just still yeah. going. He's riding for Lane now. Dedicated it. I bet you somebody's smiling upstairs right now. Run, Lane. You guys, you're killing me. <laughs> That's what he used to do. Yeah. The Rodeo Hall of Fame. Can we go see the Rodeo Hall of Fame? I know, if I, knew that was the I know deep down in my heart, he he was the the greatest influence. That that. He looks just like him. That was good. That was great. McBride and the Ride. Man. That's skill. Man. Man. Yeah, so that had tough as one of the stunt riders. Oh, it did. It's really cool to get all the home footage. Yeah. Yeah, he was 25 when he died. Man. Don't be afraid to go after what you want to do and what you want to be. That was great. Oh, yeah. All right. That was eight seconds. Yeah. What'd you think? That was good. Yeah. It was really good. I liked it. They really caught me off guard with how fast. Oh, my goodness. He died. Yeah. And I really think that they wanted to do it like that. And, you know, this is just me talking. Uh, like, to correlate it with how fast things can happen in the ring, you know, in the arena, that something can happen so quickly. Um, just that something can happen so quickly, you know, they try to do the best they can to make sure that nothing, that everybody's safe, but it's such a dangerous sport. I'm just curious if maybe there should have been something between him getting hit by the bull and cutting to the test. Like, right. There should have been something at the hospital saying, right. this is what happened. I agree. I do wish that they had elaborated a little bit, you know, especially after he died, you know, don't just cut right to the casket. You know, give me a little bit more, you know, oh yeah, special thanks to Clyde Frost, Killer everybody. Frost Cody. Yeah. Everybody, that's awesome. But yeah, I wish we had a little bit more you know, than Apollo's death. <laughs> well, because that's what people are going to ask, what happened? Yeah. Yeah. I don't I don't exactly know what happened. You know, even with Apollo, you kind of understand he broke his neck. Yeah. Where here, you know, he pushed on him, so did he right. break his back, did he puncture his lung, did he... Yeah. Like you said, did but he... But it was, you know, it was so fast, it was almost jarring. Right. 
Yeah. Yeah. And it was good. You know, I liked it. I really, I really liked, um, blown away that he died right there on the, right in the middle of the competition. Right. Yeah. You know, that hardly ever happens. Usually it's later at the hospital or right. days after or something. Um, I liked the story, how we kind of bounced around. I almost wish we got a little bit more like at the rodeo grounds. You know, we got a lot. I think they, I think they really were trying to do a lot with the movie, but it really came off very well. I think the editing was really good. I think, you know. Oh, that was fantastic. Did yeah. You could tell there was practical effects. So there was some of Luke Perry on bulls, some of him on mechanical bulls. Right. But the way they cut it and shot it, the bull spinning this way, the camera turning this way. Right. It was done really good. Yeah. It never looked fake or staged. Yeah, no, absolutely. It looked real all the time. Yeah, I just like, it would cut to him getting on a bull and going, and they were kind of shorter scenes yeah. of the bull riding. So I kind of wish we had more like the amp up, the setup to get there. But I know that it's like the same thing over and over and over again that they have to get to in the movie. Yeah. You know, so I know that there's some restraints there, but I thought it was overall really, really good. Oh, yeah, it was really yeah. good. Yeah. I really enjoyed it. Yeah. I would keep Luke it. Perry did an excellent. Man, he was so good. He was Even so Stephen good. Baldwin, who, you know, is kind yeah. of a kind of a tool of the ball ones are all tools but <laughs> it's kind of the tool brother of them all right he was great yeah they all yeah. did great yeah you know even the third little sidekick buddy clyde yeah you know he he played his part i loved his little poems that was great yeah um <laughs> yeah even the last poem i think he said he wrote or the last poem that he read i think had a credit in the movie for that, right. yeah, that someone else had maybe written a little or something. I don't know if it was that same guy, but um, Luke Perry was the best, though. Yeah, yeah. He Him really, and the the chick had really good chemistry. He really pulled off that southern, yeah, Josh G. Willikers. Right. He really pulled that off. Yeah. Well. Yeah, that was excellent. Awesome. Very good. Good suggestion. Good suggestion, guys. Appreciate that one. Yeah, we kind of been struggling for movies here lately but that one was a good one yeah, we always bring it up and yeah. never go to it and we should have we should learn right to stop going with our choices going <laughs> right <with yours. laughs> don't listen to me i gotta stop listening to me yeah but all right guys well do the things find us on patreon find us on definitely find links. us on patreon these are going to be all full length uploads yes long before they hit youtube right so check them out over there because you can either sign up for the month or you can get these just purchase them as one-offs and just, just watch the stuff you want to watch right at at patreon's lowest price for patreon's single. minimum that's yeah. the lowest they would allow me yep or i would be charging less right but it is what it is it's a great way to support the channel thanks guys appreciate you guys we'll see you later peace out millennial peace sign millennial peace sign no that's not that's like an m Oh. <laughs> Millennial peace sign. <laughs> Whatever.